So I love caramelized onions. It's, it's one of the greatest things ever. You throw it on all sorts of food, whether it's hot dogs or French onion soup, whatever you want, you throw in caramelized onions. The problem with caramelized onions is that they take forever to make. It takes forever to get that brown color, it takes forever to get them nice and soft. But if you know a special trick, you can do it in, in a really short amount of time. And part of knowing that trick is understanding the chemistry behind caramelizing onions. And caramelizing is sort of a misnomer here. What you're actually doing when you brown onions is you're, you're running through the Maillard reaction. The Maillard reaction is the same thing that happens when you when you sear a steak or, or when, you, when you cook a roast and it gets brown on the outside. And in that reaction, you react to sugar. This is a silly way to draw a sugar with an amine. And, and all sorts of things happen in this, in this reaction, but eventually you get to flavor town. This first reaction goes a lot faster if you add a base. And the base that we're gonna use to do this is baking soda. Okay, so they're in the same pot. And the difference here is that I am going to add a pinch of baking soda to the onions on the left. Just a pinch, not too much. If you add too much, the onions get all soft and mealy. And you will be able to see really quickly that they start turning brown. Look at that, they're already turning colors already. And these guys over on the, on the right here haven't done a thing. They're sitting there staring at you. So there's a chemistry trick that you can use to help your everyday life. Do you have a chemistry tip? Or maybe you can explain the chemistry behind the stuff in our everyday lives. Be a chem ambassador and send us a video for the Everyday Chemistry Contest. Enter to win a trip to the next ACS National Meeting. And to get fame and glory on Bite Size Science and in CNN. Get all the details here.